Hi, welcome back to Valley News Live. The cold is going to stick around for a while, which means that snow that's fallen is also going to stick around. And some bad news, some more snow is in the future as well. So let's take a look at our uh, temperatures for this next week. We're going to see those pinks and purples stay around, which are those temperatures in the teens and 20s as we move on throughout the week. And as we get to uh, later in the week, we're going to have a cold front pass. And that's going to mean those purples and pinks get purplier and pinker as we see more cold temperatures sticking around, or rather colder temperatures sticking around as we move into later in the week. We're going to see some single digits uh, for our lows and some teens, but in the low teens for our highs for Thursday and Friday. And right now, though, things are looking pretty calm. There are some flurries up in the Grand Forks area as well as points uh, west of there. Uh, but here in Fargo, we're seeing cloudy skies with temperatures right at 18 degrees. And those calm winds are making it feel like 18, so not much of a wind chill here. Though out west, they do have a bit of a wind chill there. Temperatures right now are mostly in the teens, though here in Minnesota, we're seeing temperatures a bit warmer, but those wind chills are definitely an issue. Right out west in Bismarck at negative 12 and Minot at minus 8, while the Devil's Lake Basin is sitting at 4 and Langdon at 6. Now, we are seeing some of those flurries just near uh, where the radar is, which is right about there. And because it's so close to the radar, it's a bit easier to pick the flurries up there. That's why we're not seeing them elsewhere. And as we look through the, after, uh, through the evening, we're going to see those temperatures fall, but not all that much as we're seeing those cloud, uh, cloudy skies, which actually traps the heat in a little bit, kind of acts as a blanket. Though we'll have single digits out in the west and upper teens in the east. Now, as we move on through the overnight hours and as you're waking up tomorrow morning, temperatures will be right in the teens while out west, upper single digits. And we're going to see some lake effect snow stick around for those downwind of those big lakes. Now, as we move on throughout the day on Sunday, we're going to see some snow start to creep into the picture again. But don't worry, nothing like we saw this past week, just some uh, heavier flurries or some light snow. Now, temperatures will be right around 20 degrees here in Fargo, and we'll see that snow chance uh, escalate for those in the Devil's Lake Basin as we move on throughout the evening hours. And as we move toward bedtime, that snow will be a bit more widespread. Now, here in Fargo, we'll start the day at a balmy 11 degrees and work our way up to 24 with those clouds sticking around, which is a similar story for much of the area. We'll see temperatures near the 20s and take a look at this sunset through those trees with the ice kind of amplifying that. Thank you, Vicki, for that photo and everyone else who sent in those uh, snow photos. Now we do have a couple chances of some light snow, just some dusting, and we'll have those 20 degrees sticking around until the end of the week where we drop back down into the, the low teens. Ouch. Ouch. <laughs> <laughs> back into the low teens. Yep. No fun, but what can we do? <laughs> yep. All right. Thank you so much, Jim. The company.